and 720 in the bank for the other day. And I'm going to report to you guys some sad, sad, gloomy news. Because know what it is? Fuck them. Also, I'm not sorry. Also, sorry. Down the business. Because I don't think a lot of you Nintendo fans see how bad of a shape Nintendo's in right now. With MPD are out for the month of January. And uh, VG charts, they had to leave selling about 70k for the month of January, which is horrible. <laughs> everybody it's mr l live 08 coming to you once again with a video i know i haven't made a video in a while but i've been working hard getting this money sometimes you have to put your priorities first and work comes first before youtube that's just all to it well back to the intro with next gen 720 saying that the Wii U is not selling well. Let's take a look at that. Well, if the Wii U is not selling well, let's look at the PS3. The first four months when it launched. And it launched worldwide. And it sold 2.4 million consoles worldwide. Let's look at the Xbox 360 when it launched. For the four months. Xbox 360 sold 2 million worldwide. And let's take at the Wii U. That's not selling. The same months. The four months. The same months that the PS3. And the Xbox 360. When it came out. 2.6 million consoles. Worldwide. So, the Wii U's not selling. So what? Who cares? Who cares about numbers? Who cares if the if the Wii U is selling more than the PS3 and the Xbox 360? But the Wii U is not selling. It's not selling the way how you want it to sell. But it's not selling. Yes, in fact, Nintendo could come out. With commercials, with more games, and have the systems flying off the shelf. They can even do a price drop and have the systems flying off the shelf. They could do that. But, like I said before, it's the Xbox 360 and the PS3, the Wii U competition. No, it's the PS4. And the Xbox 720 is his competition. And things are going to crank up later on this year. The games are going to come. We got the games that's going to come. The games are coming. We've got 114 games that's been pretty much announced or pretty much been rumored that's coming out. I mean, I don't have to sit up here and name all of them. I'm pretty sure you guys seen the article. And I'll put the article down in, in the description. But all the games that, you know, some of you guys have said that wasn't coming to the Wii U. Like Watch Dogs. Like the new Assassin's Creed. Like Grand Theft Auto. You know, those type games that you said it wasn't going to come to Wii U. They're coming. And a lot of you guys gotta you know gotta stop jumping on jumping on third party. If if the third party if if they don't want to bring their games to Wii U, then they ain't got to bring their games to Wii U. I you know I'm kind of kind of fed up you know about this you know back and forth about third parties you know bringing their games to Wii U. I I don't want no ported games. You know, um uh, you know if 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 you can't if you can't give me your best team on the Wii U. There's no use for you even bringing, you know, your games onto the Wii U. Because I'm tired of ports. Because, I mean, 
ports or ports or are, are, are just ports. I didn't sell my Xbox 360 and get a Wii U because of ports. What I got my Wii U for was for the first party games and for some new third party games that were coming onto the Wii U. That's what I got my Wii U for. That's what I got it for. I didn't get it for you know the play you know a bunch of a bunch of multiplayers. I I didn't get it for that and. That's that's what I got my Wii U for, and I think a lot of people, uh, you know, uh, uh, are just putting in light up. Oh, the Wii U doesn't have, you know, another third party game. Up oh, the third party skip it, you know. Of course they're gonna skip it because they're gonna go with the best install base, and the Xbox 360 and the PS3 has the best install base. That's just all to it. Now next year this time come talk to me about third parties you know skipping the Wii U then but as of right now if they don't want to bring their game on it I'm not worried about it the same thing with EA everybody's you know EA you know EA's uh butt hurt over the you know the origin deal you know EA and Nintendo get over it because at the end of the day both of you are going to need each other that's just all to it. And I'm going to reference what uh, Dr. Trey said in his video about, you know, about Nintendo and what Nintendo needs to do. Nintendo needs to get on the ball with advertising the Wii U. They do need to do that. They need to get on the ball. Because it's kind of pathetic when you don't even have commercials that's you know that's not even showing on television and you have the money you have you you a money making machine you have the money what are you waiting on put these commercials out and let these people know that the wii u is out here and people will go buy it because i can stand in line and GameStop at best buy and a person is getting you know getting a game and i'm saying hey that game is on the wii u and they're like you know wii u what is that I was like, you know, hey, that's a new system, you know, from Nintendo. It can play blah, blah, blah. It does this. It has a touch screen, you know, and stuff like that. And the person, they didn't even know. And that's just one example. That's just one example. Nintendo needs to get on the ball about putting these commercials out and hyping up the Wii U. That's what they need to do. They did a, they did a good job for you know the hardcore gamers that already knew you know what the Wii U is, but these other casual gamers they don't know. They don't know what the Wii U is, and it's kind of getting tiresome and kind of getting sick with Nintendo. You know, laying around in the weeds and like you know the approach that they got us like we're not worrying about it by the numbers. You know, we're selling just as much as the Xbox 360 and the PS3, so we're not worried about it. At the end of the day, you have to advertise your system. Now, I can I can't sit up here and say, you know, wait till the Xbox 360 and the and the, I'm I mean not the Xbox 360, but the Xbox 720 and the PS4 when they start to advertise and start to come out, then you start doing it. No, 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 that's ridiculous. No, you need to do it now. You need to do it now. It's a lot of stuff Nintendo needs to do now. But for some reason, they're, I don't know, they, they're just not doing it. They're, they're, I don't know if they're being stubborn, you know, but they're just not doing it. But to make a long story short, I don't want to make, you know, a real long video. I just wanted to bring a quick video and, you know, let you guys know what's, you know, what's been going on, you know, with the Wii U and, you know, a couple of news, you know, that's going around. Um, about the Wii U, I'm pretty sure you heard about um, they're gonna have a voice chat where you have more than one person doing a voice chat, and I'm pretty sure party chat, you know, that's coming too. If they're doing, you know, the voice chat and the video chat, and you know, I'm pretty sure you know all of that, you know, all of that is coming with this, you know, with this next, you know, update for the summertime when it's coming. I think. That's really going to push the Wii U, you know, even more if you have those features where you can talk to your friends, you know, right there. You can talk to your friends in game or, you know, on a party chat and and 
that, you know, <clears throat> that will even take it. I know a lot of people like, you know, like Nintendo couldn't add this stuff, you know, from the beginning. I Like I was telling Next Gen 720, basically the people that bought the Wii U from, you know, from the beginning, they're the beta, they're the beta testers. We are the beta testers. We test, you know, we're testing the system out online-wise, you know, and everything like that. Using the Miiverse, giving our feedback. And that's how Nintendo is going to, you know, get things accomplished, you know, to add with each update, you know, onto the system. So the Miiverse is a great tool for Nintendo, for Nintendo to learn from their mistakes and get the system, you know, better. People complain about, you know, the slow OS, you know, hey, they're fixing that. You know, steady little things, you know, they're fixing. Like I said, like the party chat, the uh, voice chat, you know, all of that. Nintendo is going to, they're going to add all of that and they're going to fix all of that. So we don't have to, you know, even worry about that. <clears throat> well, like I said, guys, like I always say, have a good day. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Make sure you leave your comments, you know, down below. And like I always say, peace.